The point machine is connected to the switch blades with a setting rod and a pair of independent control rods. The setting rod moves the switch blades and ensures that they stay in their desired position. The checking rods independently detect the proper position of the switch blades and also ensure that the blades stay in their desired position. The point machine is equipped with six independent sensors that safely and reliably detect the actual position of the switch blades and of the locking mechanism. The point machine has even been designed for force trailing by tram wheels. Special trailing springs ensure safe unlocking and movement of the mechanism when the preset trailing force is exceeded. The point machine can continue in operation right after the trailing, as the trailing does not damage the point machine mechanism. Power for the point machine is ensured by modern electrohydraulic systems, which ensure smooth and silent operation and prolong the lifetime of the point machine as well as of the switch point. Power supply can be taken directly from the overhead contact lines. Or engines with standard voltages are available. For example, 230 volts AC or 110 volts AC. Changing the type of the engine is very easy. Maintenance of the electrohydraulic system is also very easy. The complete block can be easily replaced within a few minutes. The box of the point machine is completely watertight and ensures protection against water, dust, and other impurities. The point machine is divided into mechanical and electrical parts by a watertight partition. Even in the case that the rubber sleeves would break, the electrical portion remains dry and the point machine remains working. Thanks to the point machine's low profile, installation into tracks is not a problem. The point machine box is only 200 millimeters high. The point machine can be easily installed into ground boxes of various manufacturers, thanks to its standard outer dimensions. Electroline